and I am officially back. And some of you guys are probably wondering, what are you talking about? You didn't upload a video yesterday, but it's not like you've been gone very long. Okay, so long story short, before we get into the Safe Moon related news, Friday, my power went out. Crazy weather storm, and power's been out up until just a little bit ago. So I haven't been able to work. I did have a video scheduled for Saturday, so thank God for that. And Sunday, um, I don't know what was going on. I don't think there was much news that seemed to happen. I'm doing the best that I can getting caught up and essentially trying to incorporate it into this video anyways. And then now today, they finally were able to get the power back on. So we have some news coming on for Safe Moon as well as that of Glow Token, and the Mirror Protocol. Let's go ahead and roll on into it. First up here, SafeMoon Spidey says, in case you missed it, Don Bailey is speculating that SafeMoon is going to drop everything this year. These being the SafeMoon blockchain, the SafeMoon NFT marketplace, the SafeMoon exchange, the card, the website. That will make a huge year for the faithful SafeMoon army. In this screenshot here, Anon says, honestly, didn't think we would see SafeMoon blockchain in 2023. However, these recent updates got me rethinking that. Progress is progressing progressively. Then you'll see what BBTF truly have planned. Don Bailey saying, in response, my guess, blockchain card marketplace exchange this year. Oh, and new website. Why is this significant in any regards? Don Bailey, who is the head for that of Blockbuster Tech, associated also with Mirror Protocol, they have an office space in the same building as SafeMoon. In fact, it's on the same floor. They have a very good relationship. It's been made clear that what Don Bailey is trying to do is essentially build out these products that can complement the SafeMoon ecosystem and working closely with the SafeMoon team. He says here, my guess. So it's not a definitive thing. He's not speaking on behalf of SafeMoon, but he seems to be pretty confident that these things will come out before the end of the year. And to be fair, we're not even in the second quarter yet. We're not even in March yet. So we still have a lot of days left until the end of the year for these possible deliveries. Now what's interesting is that in this thread, SafeMoon had responded to Timmy Crypto, who said, now try which months, lol. SafeMoon responded by saying, yes, Toberly. They then followed that up. Disclaimer, this is a made-up imaginary month for the purposes of an entertaining Twitter engagement. I don't know about anyone else. Personally, I find it kind of weird that SafeMoon is trolling the community about things related to dates when historically speaking they've been very poor in that form of uh, performance and many people are upset that things have not been delivered on this there's many people that are not upset to be fair many people are still being patient and waiting for them to deliver personally i don't think that it helps that they are trolling about delivery dates at all they could just not do it. But tell us what you guys think down in the comments below. Then we have Glow Token in their post. Glow Token Flare pre sale is live. Please visit our website for the pre sale swapper contract and the new Glow Token Flare contract address. That's through glowtoken.net slash flare. Talked a little bit about this in the past, but to keep it short, the, Go the Glow Token Flare is a new token launch that's not getting rid of the Glow token. But with Flare, it has different tokenomics. This is gonna allow them to more easily get listed on different crypto exchanges. So if you've been wondering why SafeMoon and some of these other cryptos are not on some of the mainstream uh, trading platforms, one of the big reasons is because of the tokenomics. Hence with Mandala Exchange, they've been trying to build out the global tokenomics. Technically it's Binance's team, but Mandala is more or less a subsidiary using Binance's liquidity. We haven't seen any news of a delivery date for Global Tokenomics. That was approximately a year ago now. Um, I believe it was towards the end of March for that. And I think it was the, no, actually I believe that was the end of February and the card was the end of March. Anyways, we're pretty close regardless. The good news is Glow Token presale is live. You want to jump in on this? Boom. There you go. Details on glowtoken.net forward slash flare. Then moving on to the Mirror Protocol. 
The mirror protocol initially brought you diversification packaged within a token. It then took diversification to the next level with a unique diversified cross-staking platform. Now we are shattering data analytics with an intuitively designed dashboard to view your personal performance. The Mirror Protocol, powered by Blockbuster's tech, would like to introduce the Mirror Token dashboard. That's dashboard.themirrorprotocol.com is live. Take a look into the blockchain from an easy to use, sleek user experience. And there's a little preview that they show you guys here. But if we hop over to the website, this is what you'll see. And you'll notice that there are currently two of the tokens listed. That's the BNB Mirror Protocol and the Bitcoin Mirror Protocol. We've seen teasers from the team behind the Mirror Protocol of XRP Mirror Protocol token, as well as what looks to be like a Safe Moon Mirror Protocol token. So hopefully we'll get those in the near future. And what's really nice about this too is that you don't even need to connect your wallet to look up the information on this. You just have to paste it up here in the top right hand side where it says enter wallet address. We'd see that there's a ticker at the top showcasing some of the mainstream blue chip cryptocurrencies and what their prices are. Then we scroll down, we can see the SafeMoon swap, latest transactions that have been taking place, 24 hour buy sell pressure, this just went up, so I'm assuming that after 24 hours, we'll start to see some percentage changes there. And then a little bit of a promo in the bottom right-hand corner, Moonizen's pre-mint protocol. Then move on to Blair, who shows here, just a little bit of a graphic. Simply place your OX in the enter wallet address section to view additional information. So there's a little bit of a preview of what that would look like. And then we move on to the month of February deliverables. Mirror Protocol saying update a list of February deliverables. One staking revealed, launch, and then here is where we see a little bit of a change. Mirror token dashboard that was revealed on February 3rd. Previously said it was a pending launch. Now it says that launch today, which is the dashboard we just showed you. But take notice here, three through eight, we still have reveals waiting. A list of February deliverables. February, right? Well, February is almost over. So does that mean that we're going to be getting a whole bunch of these deliveries over the course of the next day? Possibly. Let's see what happens. Gotti from the Mirror Protocol team says, reveal, educate, launch. We say what we do, and we do what we say. Next, insert. Mwahaha. So they're up to something. Safe Moon's price over the last 24 hours down 1.38%. Over the last six hours, up about 0.82%. Coinbase, a little side news for you guys. They said, we regularly monitor the assets on our exchange to ensure they meet our listing standards. Based on our most recent reviews, Coinbase will suspend trading for Binance USD or BUSD on March 13th, 2023 on or around 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So to clarify, BUSD is not from that of CZ and Binance themselves. It's from Paxos. It's a separate base company. CZ's made public statements about this. So the SEC has been cracking down on Binance USD. There's no longer the ability, at the moment at least, for them to be able to mint new BUSD. So whatever BUSD is currently out in the system is what's proactively being traded and Coinbase now being the next exchange to make the announcement. And to be totally honest with you, I didn't even know that Coinbase had any kind of trading support for Binance USD. So that's actually surprised me regardless. And that's what I got for you guys in today's video. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit subscribe, hit the thumbs up like button, and thank you so, so much. I really appreciate it, guys. To my Patreon supporters, been crazy the last year. I do YouTube full time. You can support for as little as $1 a month. It helps me to continue to do what I'm doing. I really appreciate it a lot. And a double shout out, thank you to my higher level patrons. So we love SafeMoon.com, Victor Vegas, SafeMoon Oz for being those higher level patrons. And thank you to my YouTube members for your support as well. I hope you have a great day. Thank you so much for tuning in. God bless. We'll see you in the next episode.